Hi everyone. So as you may know, I've recently turned vegan this January. It is part of Veganuary. That's what gave me the kind of kickstart, but it is something I hope to continue for life. Now, the reason I decided to go vegan was to do with breastfeeding. And the more I found out about the dairy industry and what it does to cows in terms of taking their calves away after birth, um, and mass producing milk it just really made me feel for the animals because I thought well as a breastfeeding mum one I could never imagine that happening and just to be used for the dairy industry um, I really really struggled with and I think because I could imagine it in my own head once I get something stuck in my head I find it really hard um, to not think about it and the more I researched it and what they do to baby chicks and stuff I just can't get it out my head so for me it's a small sacrifice that I can make and that will hopefully make a bit of a difference um, and I hope other people whilst I think it's easier for me because I've been a lifelong vegetarian um, it's and also I'm allergic to cheese so it is easier for me going vegan but I think for everyone it's important to have a look at you know like where your food comes from and smart swaps and ethical um, ways of getting things and consuming things because I think it's too scary for a lot of people to say go vegan do you know if you're into your meat or whatnot but even just making a small change like checking where the meat's from or maybe replacing one meal a week so it's something plant-based I think it's great for the environment and your own health as well and um, so that's kind of my main reasons for going vegan and also I hope to be healthier being plant-based it's been really interesting checking what um, is actually in food like I have to be really careful because I have had a history of eating disorders so I don't want to check too many things and too many details on every single thing but even going to pub the other day for a carvery obviously I want having the meat but even going and asking about do you know what's on the veg and there was like loads of butter on some of the veg which I would never even thought of and um, it's quite interesting to actually learn about these things so you can do you know go have steamed vegetables and personally I don't know it's the difference between steamed vegetables and buttered veg and um, so I may as well have the healthier option anyway and um, so I do hope it's going to help me be healthier and actually have more of a varied diet because I'll be challenging myself do you know I've got to make sure I've got my protein and my carbs and my veg and everything and it's been really interesting finding out actually what like what is protein and how how much protein certain plants have got um so there's lots of different smart swaps um that i'm trying to make but i think the biggest reason for turning vegan as i say was feeling empathetic with the uh, cows breastfeeding so and i also bought a bag which kind of sums it up um because everyone always says me feeding my five-year-old and two-year-old who are nearly three and six um, and aren't they too old for breast milk and this bag says aren't you too old um, for cow's milk or cow's breast milk so it's just turning it on its head and actually that is more weird that we drink another mammal's breast milk than it is that my own children drink my milk so yeah there we have it that's my main reasons for turning vegan.